Could japonica rice be an alternative variety for increased global food security and climate change mitigation? Most of the world's food insecure are in Africa and Asia, where rice, which is considered a greenhouse gas intensive crop due to methane emissions, is a staple. In seeming conflict with the world's current greenhouse gas reduction goals, annual rice production increases of 1.5% have been forecasted to meet the demand of a growing world population. Majority of which, due to socioeconomic and cultural influences, are unlikely to decrease their rice consumption. Of the two main rice varieties, indica and japonica, that are commonly grown, indica holds the largest market share of over 80%. Studies have shown that japonica rice emits 43% less greenhouse gases. The indica paddy is mostly treated to a parboiling process, and the milled grains are usually fluffy with separate kernels when cooked. While japonica is non treated and sticky. A review of the literature to determine its growth characteristics showed that indica rice grows well near the equator, while japonica rice grows mostly in the temperate and mountainous regions of Northeast Asia. The awareness, acceptability, and economics of japonica rice were evaluated using structured questionnaires in a majority parboiled indica rice consuming market. Results indicated that non stickiness and aroma. Were the characteristics that determined preference for indica rice. The impact of the parboiling treatment on japonica rice was studied, and the factors which most impacted stickiness were investigated through sensory and statistical analyses. Results showed that parboiling caused gelatinization of starch. Furthermore, adhesiveness was reduced in the treated japonica rice, thereby providing a quality that majority of survey respondents found desirable. The differences in nutritional and physical properties of untreated japonica, treated japonica, and treated indica rice were determined. Parboiling increased the micronutrient profile of the treated japonica rice, indicating that it could be a potential solution to hidden hunger. A comparison of the growing climate and greenhouse gas emissions of japonica and indica rice from previous studies showed that japonica rice is affected more by temperature than geography. Consequently, parts of Africa, India, and Bangladesh would have conducive weather for its growth. Also, with higher yields, the cultivation of japonica rice varieties will likely result in lower greenhouse gas emissions compared to indica. In conclusion, the adoption of the more nutritious, higher yielding japonica rice has the potential to help strengthen global food security and reduce hidden hunger, particularly in the world's five poorest countries. While reducing global greenhouse gas emissions.